Brandon Manson with Michigan Creative Media. We're at Wolverton today. They're one of the leading pet supply distribution centers in the Midwest. We're here today to find out what it takes to be a leader in distribution and what it takes to be efficient beyond all belief. And what you're going to find out, I think you'll be impressed. Wolverton's high-tech computer systems and warehouse technology make it the perfect place for retailers who want to expand their business and sell products online. We have roughly 290,000 square feet here in warehouse. We have all different kind of product here. This is our pack department. As the orders are dropped into our warehouse management system, um, our pullers will be out with what we call RF guns. Those orders get keyed into their guns and it directs them where to go to pick the product from. So how does an order get to the retailer? Well, here's the life of an order in about a minute. An order gets placed on the phone or through the Wolverton website and then dropped into the warehouse management system. Then around 6 p.m. that night, a box or boxes are made for that order. Each box gets a sticker with a barcode on it and then is sent down the line to the carousel station. Here, operators scan the box with their RF guns. Then product and the amount shows up on the screen while the carousel and the floor move to bring up the correct bin. Once a box is complete, it gets sent to second station called Pick to Light. At Pick to Light, the operator scans the box again and the lights tell them where to pick the product from and how many. Once that box is complete, it goes down the line for cart pick, or is finished, gets taped and is sent to the end where it is organized into the proper line where it's palleted, wrapped and sent onto a truck to the customer. The whole process is streamlined, efficient and quite amazing. It is a perfect example of distribution at its finest. Everything's based on velocity in here. So our faster moving items, the ones we ship out the most of, that's what we try to put in that carousel. So it's a lot more efficient. We use two people. It's a standstill station. You don't have to walk around. All right, we're here with Kirsten. She's a customer service rep. We're in the, uh, what is this, the land of the cubicles. Mm -hmm. uh, what exactly is it that uh, you do here? Well, we try to service our customers so that when they place their orders, we can make sure to get the products out to them. Good afternoon, Wolverton. This is Kirsten speaking. How may I help you? Have you been out there, the warehouse, the wilderness? Have you been there? It's yes. gigantic. Yes, there is a lot of product out there. How do you, how do you keep that straight? We get a program that um, gives us the information every day, the new products that arrive in our warehouse. Um, so you try to stay on top of what those items are. I mean, anything that you walk into a pet store, you know, you, that's the products we have out there. We talk a lot to our outside sales representatives, and uh, we have a great relationship with them. And, of course, they have a great relationship with our customers, and I think that whole circle, you know, makes sure that, you know, we're servicing the customers the best. As our tour wrapped up, we were amazed at the level of technology and efficiency of the Wolverton model, and were reminded that American ingenuity and hard work are still very well alive in mid-Michigan. President David Rinke wants to make sure that everyone in Wolverton has the same focus and goals to continue to provide the very best service to their customers. Trucks come in, product goes out. It's the perpetual wheel of commerce. And if you've got pet supplies or anything else for that matter that needs delivering or distributing, I think we've all seen that the Wolverton model is the way to go.